Hello, I'm Suresh Menon and welcome to this video in this manifestation series. You are what you think. You have heard this everywhere. People keep telling you. Can your thoughts really alter your reality? Do your thoughts have the power to manifest your desires? It's not that simple. What's the truth? Let's explore. In this video, I will be detailing what your thoughts are telling you how to make your thoughts more powerful and how your thoughts become a reality. Our minds work wondrously. It is active at all times. It always has what we call mm, thoughts. Did you know that the mind has almost 100,000 thoughts a day? How active can our minds be? The constant thoughts interpret and make sense of the world around us, whether you are aware of it or not. And that is where the subconscious mind of the, or the creative mind comes into existence. You might have heard it a million times. Think positively, think positively, think positively. And I'm sure that most of you have tried it consciously. However, it doesn't really help because it's impractical and it could be harmful too at times because it sets an unrealistic expectation on us that would be impossible to achieve. Because the positive thoughts have to originate from the subconscious mind. How does that come? With practice, of course, wherein your way of life changes subconsciously through repeated affirmations. Until you get there to that point, you may experience several disappointments, especially when your forced positive thinking is trying to set up a very high expectation. You may experience adverse reactions, those adverse reactions that you often have towards unpleasant things that happen to you throughout the day. Let me tell you, are all absolutely natural and normal. Not to worry at all. In fact, when you try to deny or suppress these thoughts and emotions, they can do more harm than good. So here's the truth. No thought is positive or negative. It's only on how we perceive it based on our own subconscious beliefs, values and perceptions. Additionally, when we manifest, we don't manifest what we are thinking about when we don't manifest from our emotions. Emotions, that's the critical word. Energy in motion. That said, there has to be a mind-emotion connection all the time if you want to manifest your desires. And when you don't manifest from your thoughts and emotions, you instead manifest from your subconscious conditioning that teaches you where to put your focus on, what to think, how to feel and what you think is possible. So what do your thoughts tell you? To put it simply, your thoughts tell you where you are focused. When you dive deep into your thoughts and dissect it, you will find that it is rooted to your subconscious beliefs and programming, which then creates an impact on your reality. That's why it's essential to be more aware of what you choose to put in focus on and examine your beliefs. Your, belief, your focus will also help you identify the current state of your vibrations and how aligned they are to what you want to manifest in your life. So, how do these thoughts become more powerful? Your thoughts basically have no power. It only gets power when you actively invest your attention in them that they begin to seem real. Therefore, it shapes your reality. When you engage with your specific thoughts, you begin to feel emotions triggered by these thoughts and then you enter an emotional state that influences how you act. Hope you got it. It's all about your engagement with the thoughts that run in your head. If you engage with more empowering thoughts, it will trigger your emotions and they will then create a domino effect that leads to your actions. So how do these thoughts become your reality? As mentioned, your thoughts alone can't alter your reality, but it's the way you behave and act that define who you are and your experiences in life. Those of you scientifically inclined can check out on another video of mine on this channel which explains how quantum physics explains this phenomenon of energy becoming matter. That said, all your issues are nothing more than a thinking problem. 
the real issue here is how you think about your problem not your circumstances therefore the need to develop a healthy thought pattern when it comes down to it it's not the easiest thing to do in the world just imagine all those thoughts running inside your head still the power lies within you what are the thoughts that you choose to engage with to manifest your desires that is the question manifest what you want in life by developing a healthy thought pattern stay tuned to this channel for plenty of tips in manifestation and self development